foul is on Bruce Bowen. That's his fourth personal foul. Ori has four as well. Rip Appleton was totally under control. He came off that curl. He was defended. He did not want to put up a poor percentage shot. Shot clock at seven as Billups puts it up and he draws the foul. Now this is a tough cover for Tony Parker right now. With the game on the line, you know that Billups can either post them up on a pass and post or he can take them off the dribble down inside. It's a tough cover. And you can see the San Antonio shirts are looking to come to double team. So you know that any time they clear a side or post up Billups, the double team will come. That will break down the defense of the Spurs. Parker takes one in the chops, commits his third personal. Each team now with 14 fouls, so they'll shoot free throws the rest of the way. Phillips, 90% free throw shooter. Tonight, seven out of eight from the strike. He has 27 points. Crowd quiets down. To give Phillips full concentration as if he needs it. He drops the ball. 81 79. Corey leaves it now for Ginobili. Prince stays with him. Mano's going to drive all the way, lay it up and in. Mano Ginobili now with 15 points in the game. Now that was a tough shot. As he came off the screen, he read the defense perfectly. The defender fought over the top. The defender thought he had him. That was a difficult shot. 2.30 to play. Hamilton. 83-81, Detroit. One of the very few times tonight that you could see Rip open up. Open on that right baseline. Hamilton with 15. Ginobili had driven to tie the game. Mono Ginobili scoring to tie it, but then that's answered by Hamilton at the other end. Now that is a tough shot. He had to get that up over Rasheed. And this was just a great freeze on the screen. The defensive man cheats, I fade. And there is Vinny Johnson. Two titles of the Pistons, 89 and 90. We've had nine lead changes. The game has been tied 15 times. The law of averages said we were going to have a great game. <laughs> we have a great game. What do you look for down the stretch here, Yubi? Right, the main thing right now is you understand both teams are shooting the penalty. You must take care of the defensive boards and look for the easy shot. And Ori goes to the hoop and gets fouled. Ben Wallace coming over. Ori winds up going into the first row. You love it when teams come out of timeouts and they set whatever they set up. You get the execution and you then you get the guy that you wanted to make it happen. That was just a strong move by Robert Ory. Foul on Rashid Wallace. And that is his fourth personal foul. He is the only piston now with four. You have Bowen and Ori with four reach. For the Spurs. Now, from now to the end, you really must clear up how you're covering pick and roll, whether they're at the top of the circle or whether they're out on the wings. And then, are you going to follow Rip Hamilton at the defensive end on down screens, or are you going to shoot the gap? You must make major decisions here now of how you're going to defend the strike. Corey, a 74% career free throw shooter. First time he's been to the line tonight. Drops both and we're tied at 83 with 215 to play in the fourth quarter. Now San Antonio, two full timeouts in the 22nd. Detroit, two full timeouts. They have used their 22nd. We have a team in the foul to give. We'll shoot free throws the rest of the way. Rasheed Wallace on a turnaround. That was beautiful. Rasheed, there was a screen for Rasheed on the opposite side. And as Rasheed came, he had Duncan on his back. He stopped. He did not come across the lane. Chauncey made the perfect pass. Ginobili lays one up short, but Ori is there to follow. How about this guy? Big shot bomb. Hits the three-point land or something like that to Absolutely. tie the game. 
He, he's just Mr. Intangible. He's everywhere, and you must pay attention because he keeps things alive under pressure on your offensive board. Corey seeking his sixth championship ring, has 10 points in the quarter. Chauncey Billups, he scores. You love it. Don't you love it? This young man just loves the pressure. That was a great move. He knows that he can take that clock down, either post, run a spin move, or take Parker off the dribble. 34. And Ori. Oh, Robert Ori. Wow. Doesn't matter what uniform he wears, what arena it's in. Robert Ori. 88, 87. Spurs by one. He's open. Hamilton. And Duncan gets the rebound, but can't stay in bounds. And they're going to say forced out by Hamilton. Now that's a, that's a foul. So consequently, they'll be shooting. Now, Rip Hamilton opened up, had a wide open shot. There's no doubt about it. Keep an eye right here. You're going to see now he gets pushed in the back by Hamilton. That's a foul. You shoot it at the other end. Forced out. The foul is called. That's four personal fouls now on him. Back to Ori for the three pointer to give them the lead. Duncan at the free throw line now. Just uncanny how Robert Ori to take the pressure. Big game after big game, no matter what is on the line, and just shoot it with such confidence. Ori has seven points in 58 seconds. If you're going to foul, you must put Duncan. Duncan must go to the line and make the foul shot. He's now three for eight in this ball game. And he's 0 for four in this quarter from the free throw line. Good. Missed that one, too. And Prince. We'll take a timeout for Detroit. So it's 59.3 seconds to play. Detroit with the ball and San Antonio with the lead. Robert Ory, 34 years old, seeking his sixth ring. He scored his first points of the game with one second to play in the third quarter on a three-pointer. He opened up the fourth quarter with a three-pointer. He's hit all the big shots here. He has 16 points all since the one-second mark of the third quarter, and San Antonio has the lead, 88 to 87. Well, when he passed Michael Jordan a few games ago for the most three-point shots made in the playoffs, Michael Jordan was at 42. Now, Robert Ory is at 48, and in this series, he's now 10 for 21, Al, from three-point range. It's just beautiful to watch. You're very happy for him. He's a great team player. He's all, all the intangibles, all the dirty work. He can come in and play, you know, a small forward, a power forward for you, and then he wants the ball with the clock going down. And Chauncey Billups, 30 points tonight. He'll drive. He'll go all the way. He'll put it in. They caught the defense with their back turned that time. As soon as Chauncey Phillips blew by his man.